What does it mean to follow the scenario of your parents? It's not a secret that children often observe the behavior of their parents and may replicate or imitate it. Parents serve as role models and children tend to learn by example incorporating aspects of their parents' behavior into their own actions and habits. Sometimes place of parents could be taken by any significant other as grandparents, for example, aunt and uncle, neighbors who helped a lot to raise up a kid, people who actually participated in educational process and their behavior or attitude and relationship between each other could influence and it was demonstrated to a child and was taken by a child how to behave and build up relationship with the world outside. So, following the scenario of your parents or other important people typically refers to adopting or replicating the life choices, behaviors or patterns that your parents demonstrated uh, in their own lives. It can involve aspects like career choices, relationships, lifestyle or values, or even goals and dreams sometimes. Of course, in that experience could be good and bad. Depends. We all came from trauma, we all came from childhood, we all have our background. Example number one. Let's say father had an addiction and he turned to be an aggressive while consuming alcohol. So daughter, when she became an adult, when it came the time to open up her heart, fall in love and maybe get married or uh, come to relationship, serious relationship, she is scared. And uh, because for her marriage is a sign of unsafety and danger. How to unfollow this scenario? How to go opposite? To work out the fear of falling in love, family creation, fear of getting close with somebody and uh, build up that strong belief that everybody is different and to find the best husband who has no addiction and every day of your life it could be a wonderful proof that you can experience beautiful healthy lifestyle together example number two it was related actually to me my family itself my parents happily lived together 33 years and the only reason for argument in their case it was uh, business because they work together they built up a few companies together and uh, they had equal rights and equal strong sides I could be caught into the fear of building up business with your significant other but my husband and I have absolutely different strong sides so we agreed since beginning that our responsibilities would be different my husband is an incredible decision maker and businessman and I'm a creative human being but he's creative as well so we developed our app and business together and we know and we don't go on the territory of <laughs> of each other and uh, i'm not caught by my fear i was actually guided uh, by the great example because my parents they were happy as well so i've seen a beautiful side of it and i decided why did i make it even more beautiful and uh, by now everything is doing great and I have to tell you that this product and our company uh, and our family business even makes us closer because we have common hobby and interest and passion. So example number three, let's say as well, husband and wife, they built up relationship, but it was at that time um, when um, man decided that it's better for the family reasons for his wife to be at home to be a mother to sit at home with no working and he's taking all responsibility but after years of success he turned up to be aggressive possessive or maybe jealous about his wife so or maybe it was since the beginning so he didn't want her to show up in the society and he took all good care financial care and children have seen that but um let's say another good example with the daughter daughter is growing up and she sees oh, okay my mother she was caught into financial responsibility and she suffered she suffered under physical emotional mental abuse and she decided okay i will go into opposite direction i will go into anti scenario but it didn't work out for her very well because she decided i will be workaholic with no sleep no good feeding habits i will exhaust myself but i will make all money in the world and she did the only one thing she stayed without family without having kids without a little pleasure in life so when you see uh, and recognize your fear you have to understand where is love there is no fear where is fear there is no love so you have to understand what you are guided by what's your choice is it love or it's to follow your fear and would be caught actually in danger of this fear because it can stay with you forever i wish you to choose number one that is love 
because it always comes first.